All right, I wanted to show you the uh, the finished. Uh, I didn't exactly know how to. I just sort of stain it just a little bit. How to go about finishing this specific uh, abstract, but. I could have stained it a lot darker, but I thought it would look nice enough just the way it was. Um, as you can see, uh, I sanded it just a little bit and messed with it just a little bit. And uh, I antiqued it. And uh, it came out alright. came out okay. And uh, I also want to show you the, uh, this is the Hawaiian fish hook necklace. Uh, now you can do one of the things, you can make it the way it does with the tiny, with the uh, string around it here, or you can drill a hole through here and just put you a necklace through it, in other words, it doesn't matter. Um, like I said, I didn't know what a Hawaiian fish hook was to begin with, but uh, this is what it is, and uh, that's the one made out of butternut, and it's finished. So, the, uh, both of the, uh, uh, pieces see if I can just set something here and set this up for you to see kind of a okay there you go but the little abstract uh, I've already got somebody that wants it so so uh, I like I said that that's I don't do a lot of abstract and uh, but uh, it was well, it's a lot of fun to do things you don't normally do. Uh, I, I don't do Hawaiian fish hooks either, and you know you, I ended up with this. So, <laughs> so anyway, that's the two pieces. That's the uh, abstract figure of the kissing couple, and then this is the uh, Hawaiian fish hook necklace that you can use. I kind of like the idea where you just uh, take and drill the hole through it, and then put you a uh, a, a chain necklace through it be nice but anyway that's our two projects and god bless you now been a good little projects and uh, uh we'll continue with more requests later thank you now god bless